This video will cover the topic, solving a rational equation that simplifies to linear, unlike binomial denominators. Let's jump right into an example problem. Say we're given the following rational equation, and we're asked to solve for x. I see that there are x's in the denominators. x can't equal anything that makes the denominator zero, right? That's right. Our first step to solving this problem is figuring out all values of x that would give a denominator of zero, and then excluding these values from our possible answer. We set the denominators equal to zero, and solve for x. We see that both equations are true when x equals negative three, so we exclude the value x equals negative three, since that would give us a denominator of zero. Next, we need to clear the fractions in our equations. We can do this by multiplying both sides of the equation by the least common denominator. How do we find our least common denominator in this case? The denominator 3x plus 9 has factors of 3 and x plus 3. The denominator x plus 3 only has the factor x plus 3. Okay, so we use the factor x plus 3 once and the factor 3 once to determine the least common denominator of 3 times x plus 3. Exactly. Now we multiply both sides of the equation by 3 times x plus 3. We can clear our fractions and simplify the equation. When we do this, we obtain a final answer of x equals negative 5 thirds. Negative 5 thirds is different from the excluded value we determined earlier, so this is our final answer. Okay, so to solve a rational equation with unlike binomial denominators, we first need to exclude all values of x that would give a denominator of zero. Next, we find the least common denominator of all the fractions, and we use this to multiply both sides of the equation in order to clear the fractions. We then simplify to determine our final answer. That's exactly right. Great work!